Harmony Day celebrates Australia's cultural diversity. It's about inclusiveness, respect and a sense of belonging for everyone. Well, I'm from Kenya, I was born over there and um, me, my brother, and my mother and my father, we came over to Australia in 1999. We were probably one of the first African families you know, integrating into Australia, it wasn't really too much of a support network. You've been raised up in a country where, you know, you speak a different language and you have an accent, just little things like that when you go, you go to school. And kids, naturally, they're, they're not as sensitive to certain things. So going there, you kind of learn that you're in a different country and you have to adapt quite quickly. It was kind of a thing where any any family from Kenya that would come over, you know, you would go to the airport, you pick them up and you instantly create a connection because you're both here from the same place and you you have similarities. And now, you know, the amount of people that have come to Australia who've immigrated and are doing well for themselves is is too many to count. So yeah. The way I was introduced to football in Australia was that my brother would um, was playing soccer at school. Naturally, me being the little brother, I would go watch them train and be there on the side wanting to join in. And then just eventually through that, it let me join their training sessions. And then when I was of age to, to play in my own team, then I joined, I signed up. And it's good to see that, you know, we're getting, there's a lot of African Australian players who are getting their chance at whether it be A-League level, MPL level or, you know, just lower leagues. But um, yeah, it's, it's fantastic and you see that the, the pathway is there. I think it inspires and gives, gives the, the, the younger generation of Africans in Australia that kind of aspiration and they see that it's possible to, for, for them to play in the A-League or to do well and go overseas or play in the national team. And, yeah, it's just fantastic that that, that's, that opportunity is there for us. It's very multicultural, especially here um, out in the West. All the, the fans is one thing I've noticed that they're very passionate and they're very, they're very proud of this club. The fact that it's kind of their club from the area that they're from. And having only been here, this is my first year at the Wanderers, it's, it was prevalent from the first time that I came here and everyone puts their differences aside and uh, they come together as one and, and that's that's a fantastic thing. I think no matter your race, colour, ethnicity, creed, you know, it's it's a great way to unite people and, and bring them together under that that banner of Harmony Day. It's a good way to start to start that get that thought process going and then whether that can continue into someone's everyday routine, you know instead of just on Harmony Day, you know, having that mindset of inclusiveness. If you can continue that throughout your life, then, you know, Harmony Day is a great way to start that initiative.